Hey guys, welcome to Dispatch Garage. I'm in the office. I'm in the office today. Got a little bit of time, not much. Uh, today I'm going to talk about Internet Truck Stop. It's a it's a load board, and it's just like a, like a review if if you should get it. Um, and in my other videos, if you go back, you could see me using it. The one like the iPad video while driving. Yeah, I do it there. But my my review on truckstop.com, Internet Truck Stop, it's it's a it's one of my favorite ones. But it could use an update. You know, uh, it says it's a live feed, live feed, but it's not much live. You gotta always hard refresh the page. Um, one thing they need to um, do is bro not let brokers post the same load a hundred times. That's so annoying. You know, you're looking at a load board and now you can see a, some cheap paying load that you don't want. You know, and that's one of the things. You know. I think they should get rid of it. and a couple other things. They just have too much info on one page. I think that's what makes it kind of slow, but it's one of my favorite ones to use, and uh, I would I would recommend it. I mean, I think they raised the price right now, a hundred dollars per screen, and I got four screens right here, and that's expensive, four hundred dollars just for load board. Um, I'll show you guys my setup right now. It's kind of a mess over here, but this is my setup. I got four screens here. You know, basic. I got a notepad, phone. Phone is on there. It's just the screen turns off. But um, yeah, this is what my desk looks like. Right there, boom. So yeah. Um, what other load boards I like is, well, that are not too bad, is PowerDAT. So PowerDAT.com. It's all right, it's not as user-friendly as Internet Truck Stop. Uh, all the other ones, I feel like they're just knockoffs. Um, I feel like they post on PowerDAP first, the load comes out first there, and then it goes on Truck Stop, and then all the rest. So if you, I feel like if you have these two, you should be good. You shouldn't need any more load boards if you're a load board hunter. Um, so yeah, um, for cars, I use Central Dispatch. Let me show you here. So right now I'm looking for loads. It says origin, we're out of where, radius is maximum only 100, Spokane, 100 miles. And here's just like more advanced search options. So you go in down here, click search. And you know, out of Portland right now, only one car. That's what you do, you call a number here or they'll have a number here and you tell them the ID, order ID number. And that's how you book a car. Um, simple, easy. Central Dispatch is not user friendly though. Central Dispatch is really hard to use and it's it's not for user friendly. I mean, I hate using it, but for cars, for stuff like that, you know, like I'll use it just to book something, you know. So that's my take on the load boards, internet truck stop, power down, central for cars. Um, so yeah, there you have it. If you have any more questions, let me know. Subscribe, like, do all that stuff, if you will. Well, thank you for watching.